already like even with the civil war, this is old, or is it just it, it, like as it? I, I'll, I, I, will, I think I should let you say you should read it. Her first song is if you read it, which which is sort of funny because she's talking about being from Ireland. Like, I guess maybe what it's really admiring is that you should admire the beauty of the Ireland and the things that they do for England and the other ways that they do. So it's like almost. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six. See how that sounds to you. This is super loud. Should I make it softer? I don't need it. You don't need it? Yeah, yeah. I'm going to put it to the side for now, then way to the side. Should I lower this, Rabbi? I think you sound fine. Yeah, I think it's a little hey, Talk loud. to me. Let's come out this way. Um, Shabbat shalom. Shabbat shalom. Uh, Shabbat, yeah, you're louder than I am. I'm, I'm louder. Yeah, you're louder. I am. Yeah, yeah I think you're fine, though. Okay. But how does it sound to you? How does it sound over there? Over there. Uh, listen to the other one. Ten, nine, eight. So are we peaking at all? Shabbat shalom. How are you doing? Uh, we're good. And how's and she doing? What about me? Check one, two, three. One, two, three. Woo. Okay. Great. It'll be louder. Yeah. So you can. Do you want me to turn it down? Okay. Check. Ah. There we go. So I was going to say, I can't, like, I want to hear the process. I hear about the process of you writing your pieces. June 27th. It's a little mischievous, but I would love, I would love that. Good. Throw up uh, another two minutes. No, two minutes. Perfect. Perfect. Add another two-minute timer to it. And what? Add a two-minute timer, because we're not going to be ready for the two minutes, obviously. It sounds amazing. Oh, yeah, yeah. It's, the delay is like 15 mm -hmm. seconds. But add, oh, good. You started the two-minute. Man, you are fast now on that. I was like, what is she doing? Yeah. begin in literally one minute and 23 seconds. I don't need this here.
I'd like to welcome everyone, even the small in sanctuary crowd, to tonight's Yiskor service. Four times a year we gather to remember. We gather to remember, to reflect, to think about those we have loved and lost, to think about those who have played special roles in our lives but are no longer present on this earth. And Judaism gives us this time to yiskor, to remember. And that's what we are doing tonight, remembering. So if you have a book either in front of you or at home, we are going to be on page 577. And we're going to begin with S.I. Ani. Blessed, blessed is the match, match consumed in kindling a flame. Blessed is the flame that burns in the secret fastness of the heart. Blessed is the heart with the strength to stop its beating for honor's sake. Blessed is the match consumed in kindling a flame. As I light this candle, we begin to really think about those those who are no longer present. We think of a brother or a sister, a husband, a wife, a grandparent, or sadly, even a child. People we have lost, but people who always live on in our hearts. We turn to page five hundred and. 74, for Adonai Ma'adam. Adonai Ma'adam. Adonai, what are we that you have regard for us? What are we that you are mindful of us? We are like a breath, our days are as a passing shadow. We come and go like grass in which the morning shoots up renewed and in the evening fades and withers. You cause us to revert to dust, saying, Return, O mortal creatures. Would that we were wise, that we understood where we are going. For when we die, we carry nothing away. Our glory does not accompany us. Mark the wholehearted, and behold the upright. They shall have peace. Adonai, you redeem the soul of your servants, and none who trust in you shall be desolate." I'd like everyone to put their books to the side for a moment. And we're going to take a few moments for meditation. I'd like you to sit up straight in your seats. And if your feet reach the floor, let them sit flat on the floor. If not, place them wherever they are comfortable. I'd like you to let your shoulders relax by pushing them behind you and holding them together for just a moment and then releasing your shoulders. Let's take a deep breath in and hold it and let it out. Another deep breath in. 
Hold it and let it out. One more deep breath in. Hold it and let it out. On this breath in, clench your toes inside of your shoes and hold them. Breath in, clench your toes. Holding, holding, holding. Relax. And on this deep breath, take your hands and ball them into fists. Breath in. Holding those fists as tightly as you can. Holding, holding, holding. Breathe out and let go. Allow your hands to find a comfortable spot in your lap. Another deep breath in. And on the out, let your head drop. And on this breath in, let your head roll to the left or to the right. And hold, hold, hold. Exhale. And your head comes back to center. Another breath in, going in the opposite direction. Holding, holding, holding. Exhale and return to center. Allow your head to lay wherever it is comfortable. Another deep breath in. Holding it and out. As you continue to breathe in slowly and deeply, I want you to think of someone who's no longer here on this earth. Someone you love. Someone you've come to remember today. Picture their face. Their eyes. Their lips. Now remember a moment with them. A good moment. Where are you? Is it day or night? Are you inside or outside, alone or in a crowd? Is there an aroma in the air? Cooking or flowers? Maybe a new car smell? What are you doing and what are you saying? Take a moment and remember. Now reach out and hold the person or hold the hand of the person whom you are remembering. Hold it and feel its strength and its warmth. Feel the texture of this person's skin and be connected to them. Hold their hand. Enjoy the moment. Live in it. And remember... We turn to page 576 for the singing of the 23rd Psalm. Cantor Noah. Adonai roi lo echsav bine ode sheyabitze Yeah, 
חניכני במעגלי צדק, ינחני במעגלי צדק, למען שמו. I'm at the top of page 581. My mother's mother died in the spring of her days, and her daughter did not remember her face. Her portrait engraved upon my grandfather's heart was erased from the world of images after his death. Only her mirror remained in the home, sunken with age into the silver frame. And I, her pale granddaughter, who does not resemble her, looked into it today as into a pool which conceals its treasures beneath the waters. Very deep behind my face, I see a young woman, pink-cheeked, smiling, and a wig on her head. She puts an elongated earring on her earlobe, threading it through a tiny hole in the dainty flesh of her ear. Very deep behind my face, the bright goldness of her eyes sends out rays, and the mirror carries out the tradition of the family that she was very beautiful. We rise for the Yisker prayer. We are on page 580. Tonight I'm going to recite both prayers on this page because the first one or for those we've come to personally remember. And the second prayer, or for the martyrs. And we've had so many martyrs lately. Martyrs in the Ukraine, martyrs in grocery stores, martyrs in schools, martyrs in doctors' offices. Everywhere we turn, there's another martyr. And it wouldn't seem appropriate tonight not to say the second prayer on the page. Now, after I'm done saying both of these prayers, please quietly say the names of those you've come to remember. So their names, well, are present in this room. Yizkor Elohim nishmot yikarai. May God remember forever my beloved ones who have gone to their eternal rest. 
May they be at one with the one who is life eternal. May the beauty of their lives shine forever. And may my life always bring honor to their memory. Yizkor, Yizkor Elohim. May God remember forever our brothers and sisters of the house of Israel who gave their lives for the sanctification of the divine name. May they be at one with the one who is life eternal. May the beauty of their lives shine forevermore. And may my life always bring honor to their memory. Take a moment and remember when you're done remembering, you may be seated. Let us rise for El Malay Rachamim. We are on page 582. Let us read the English at the bottom of the page together before Cantor Noah chants it for us. Fully compassionate God on high, to our loved ones who have entered eternity, grant clear and certain rest with you in the lofty heights of the sacred and pure, 
whose brightness shines like the very glow of heaven. Source of mercy, forever enfold them in the embrace of your wings. Secure their souls in eternity. Adonai, they are yours. They will rest in peace. Amen. Elmaleh. El male rachamim shochen ba meromim hametzem menucha nechona tachat kanfei hashechina b'maalot kedoshim Kezohar Harakia Mazhirim Et Nishmat Yakirainu Shal Hule Olamam Began Eden Temenu Hatam Lachen bal harachamim Yasirem beseter knafav leolamim Veitzror Veitzror Betzror achayim et nishmatam Adonai hu nachalatam Veyanuchu Beshalom Al Mishkavam Venomar Amen We turn to page 598 for the Mourner's Kaddish. I know that the sounds, the dinner that's about to start, are starting to seep through. Joy and sadness are often side by side. And one moment we're mourning someone, and the next we're celebrating the birth of a new child. The moment is thin like the wall behind us. But for a moment, let's remain together in remembering as we do the mourner's Kaddish. We are on page 598. Yitkadal v'yikadash me'i rabba b'alma divrach hirutei v'yamlech malchutei v'chayechon v'yumechon v'chayei d'chol b'yit Yisrael v'agala v'zman kari v'imru Yehei shmei rabba m'varach le'olam olamei amaya yit barach v'yishtabach v'yit pa'ar v'yit roman v'yit naseh Vieta dar, vieta le, vieta lal, shme de kudsha, brechu. Leila, min kol, birchata, vishirata. Tushbahata, venechemata. Damiran, bialma, vimru. Yehe, shlama, rabba, min shmaya. Vichayim, alenu, vial kol, Yisrael, vimru, amen. O se shalom, bimromav. Hu ya se shalom. Aleinu ve'al kol Yisrael, ve'al kol Yoshvei Tevel, v'imru, amen. May the one who makes peace on high grant peace to all of you, to all who mourn, to all Israel, and to all humankind. And together we say, amen. amen. This concludes our Yisker service. Uh, Shabbat services, our Dolpanei Mitzvah, starts at 6.30. We're now going to stop our stream. <laughs>